good day to all of you in today's class you will appear for a practical test you all need to make the pictures that have been given here to you without taking any help this is a practical test in which you need to look at the pictures given and make the same pictures yourself you will be given 45 minutes only for the test now let us go ahead and begin the test in today's class the pictures that you need to make are first picture will show a smiling face the next one will be of a rocket in the third image with the help of the text tool you have to write down something about yourself and also have to make four stars in all of these pictures the tools which have been used are the same that you have learned during module 1 of this course look at the pictures since you have all made this picture earlier it should now not be difficult for you to see the picture and make it on your own now all of you students start making the picture and after you are done show it to your teacher if you are not able to make these pictures then watch the videos again and learn how to make these pictures and then make your pictures and show them to your teacher select the oval tool select color one as green and then drag an oval like this next we select the dark brown color as color one and drag an oval here to make the mouth in the face next we have selected color one as black and we have made a small oval here we select the selection tool rectangular selection and do a control c to copy and a control v to paste remember that when we bring this to make the first eye it will make the green line disappear to make the green line appear again we select transparent selection next we keep doing a control v and make the other eye now we do a control v again and bring that to make the hair on the face so we will now be continuously doing we have once done a control copy control c to copy and next we are only doing control v to make copies to make the paste of that copy and we are just moving that to make the hair so we continue this we pick another copy by pasting and bring it here we keep bring another copy and paste or uh, paste it there and bring it on this to make the hair it is very easy once you start practicing it you will find it very easy remember that to drag the copy that you are pasting on the left top of the drawing sheet you have to keep the mouse uh, left button or the touchpad left button pressed and then drag to where you want to bring the copy so like this we are going to complete one set of here we take one more copy paste and bring it here we do one more control v paste and then drag it here and now we want to make another set some more here on top also so we make one more we do a control v and then drag that to the top of the here like this watch the video carefully and you will find that it is easy to make this picture of a face we are continuing to do control v and once the paste happens we bring we are uh, continuing to drag that paste 
to where we want the hair. So we are making the hair like this and we will continue till we have got all the hair made on the face like in the original drawing. Like this, this way. We want some more, so we do a control V, another a copy gets pasted, then we bring it by uh, transferring it here. So we are dragging it to where we want. So this way, this picture of the face gets completed. The next picture is of a rocket which you will make with line and rectangle tool and after you are done show it to your teacher. If you are not able to make these pictures then watch the videos again and learn how to make these pictures and then make your pictures and show them to your teacher. In order to make the picture of a rocket, so we first select the rectangle tool, choose color 1 as black and color 2 as white, uh, dark brown and if from fill option choose solid fill and then drag a rectangle like this which will have a outer boundary of black and dark brown inside color is filled in. Next, we change the color to and drag a rectangle as is being shown in the video. Like this. In this case, the outer boundary is black whereas the inner color is the same as color 2 which is blue. Remember to click on the side of the drawing to remove the dotted lines. Next, we have changed the color to, to a dark gray color and we are dragging another rectangle as is shown in the video. Once again, we change the color to from the color palette and drag a third rectangle Now we need to draw the head, top a head of the rocket. So we go here and we need to draw slanting lines. First we let us make this rectangle inside the rocket. In this case we have chosen color 1 as black and color 2 as white. So we get a white rectangle. Now we go and change the tool to line tool and make these lines here like this a vertical line we adjust it and make the line there we click on the outside of the drawing to remove any dots and dotted lines. Next we make a horizontal line like this to make the boxes in this rectangle. We make another horizontal line. After each line remember to click on the outside of the drawing to remove the dots or the, any dotted lines. Make another line. Like this we continue. If you watch the video carefully, you will find that it is very easy to make this drawing. We draw here another line, a horizontal line again. 
another horizontal line so we will keep doing this till oh, we have number of horizontal lines in this rectangle that we have just drawn now we need to draw the last horizontal line so that is done next we will be drawing the top the head of the rocket so we need to draw a slanted line as is being shown in the video and join this line from this point to this point so the top end of the rocket is ready also now we need to make the wings on the side so we draw a slanted line like this We will draw another line from this point going downwards as is being shown here like this and then we need to join this end point of this line to the rocket body so like this. So one side the wing is ready we also need to make another wing on the other side similar to the one which we have made here so we make a slanted line then from the end point we need to take a line going slightly upwards join this last point of the line to the body of the rocket like this so we have the two wings made now we need to make the flame part so we come here from this point we make a slanted line going horizontally on the other side towards the back like this then we take slightly a small line going upwards or towards the right side you can say one more time a slanted line from here going horizontally backwards because the flame is going backwards when the rocket is going forward so we make this slanted line and then from here we make a slanted line coming back here like this and just like we have drawn on the top side of the rocket we'll make another small mountain type or a triangle type of drawing here to complete the flame so we join this here like this so our main drawing of the rocket is now complete let us try and fill some colors so we select as color one and we select the solid fill tool and we fill in these places the color that we have selected in color one palette we go back select a different color color one and on the top of the rocket we fill in with this bluish color now we have selected the dark brown color and we keep filling the boxes that we had made one after the other so we as you notice in the video we are leaving one box in between and we are filling the other colors like this next using the text tool you have to write about yourself you can write your name your school's name class father's name etc do remember that each of these lines that you write should be in a new line and after you are done show it to your teacher the next picture is of a star which you have to make using the line tool and fill with color option and after you are done show it to your teacher if you are not able to make these pictures then 
watch the videos again and learn how to make these pictures and then make your pictures and show them to your teacher. In order to make this star triangle picture, we select the line tool and then in the drawing sheet, drag a line as is being shown. Then drag another line from the top of the first line and then we just join the endpoints of these first two lines. So our triangle is ready. Now we have to make a five sided figure. So we make one more line slanting downwards as is being shown in the video. Then make a horizontal line like this, which is also parallel to the third line that we made. And from here, this from this end point, we will join the other point of the triangle. We are making cross diagonals as is being shown in the video from one point to the other. And then from here to here like this. Next, we need to make two more lines to have our star triangle completed and then we will be using solid fill for filling in colors. The fill in tool we will use. So first we have to make two more diagonals from this area to the top triangle till here. So let's make those two lines also. Watch the video carefully and you will be able to draw this picture very easily. We have to now go from this corner to the top like this. So this way we have one more line here. Only one last line is remaining. So we re always remember to remove the dotted dots at the ends of the lines by clicking on the side of the drawing. This completes our star triangle. Now we will use the fill tool, fill in tool to fill colors. We select a color, select the fill in option and go and fill color here. We fill dark brown. We next take the grayish color fill here. We go and change the color again to red and fill in here. And finally, we need two more, two, three more colors. We fill in here. We change it one more time and come and fill in this triangle now. And now in the center, we would like green. So we have selected green and this way you complete the star triangle picture. Save your file here. Well, now today's lesson ends here. So please properly shut down your computers. Thank you.